1970s, the Women's Center at UMKC began because of a woman, I believe, because of Ruth Marklin. And the fact that UMKC's Women's Center is still going strong, is bigger and better than it ever was, um, is just an awesome thing. Um, my work in this exhibit is about women. Um, we're, we're all multifaceted. There are so many aspects of us that um, women carry, and I believe that women have to share. If I look around the room at the work, each of us comes from a different background, and each of us brings our unique experience to our work, and so I would like to hope that we are opening up dialogue. I think that when I look around the room and I think about what it is that I have to say, if it can't be funny, it's not worth saying. And what this exhibit means to me is actually a huge range of um, how women want to portray themselves. And part of what I had to say had to be making fun of it. I think that the most important part is the different viewpoints that each one of the women has. I mean, the, the intricacy of the handwork that's in the tapestries and the history that's in the photography and the texture that's in the sculptures and the silliness that's in some of the titles. I think people should think and think what they want. This is a powerful exhibit because it's about so wonderful women and it's the theme of it. Uh, about women just taking their places. Uh, we all have a different perspective of what a Wonder Woman is and how great we are. We as artists, women artists, are just as good as the men. And also to buy our art, <laughs> that, is, that is one of the greatest things I want you to take away. And just know that we put a lot into this and we don't take what we do lightly. We appreciate the gift that God has given us and we enjoy what we do and the creativity of all our work put together is just, it says so much, it speaks volumes about what when Wonder Women we are. Um, my work speaks to the African American female experience and the African American experience as a community. The pieces that are in this exhibit are a part of the Legacy Series. There are 40 pieces in the group and they speak to African American women, the spirit of these women, their, their ancestral movement through coming into this country, coming into the United States. And I applaud UMKC for continuing this program. The Her Art Project is very important in, in, in forwarding the efforts of women in the arts and recognizing those things. We really do have to be supportive of one another and be supportive of women in the arts. Um, not just African American women, not just Jewish women, not just Italian women, white women. We have to be collectively together, standing together on what on the side of right. This exhibit means that women get to express themselves, their beauty, their power, their light. I selected my piece shutting because to me the, the soul can sometimes become tainted. I feel like it is important for us to look within and let go of those layers. And then my piece, um, Towards Clarity, my painting, is the same, same concept. My work is there to give that message of, you know, let's move towards clarity. Let's let go of the things that don't work in our life because life is full of beauty, love, and magic. To me, this exhibit is about women who have found their purpose, their destiny, and they express themselves through art. This exhibit gives women power. Women, even powerful women, don't know they're powerful or don't, or not accepted as being powerful or, or want to be something else. This is about being who we are and appreciating who we are and loving who we are no matter what. I didn't just select these pieces, I made them particularly for this exhibit because I wanted to say some things. There was a woman and she came up to look at my work and she said, I turned around and I saw myself and I grabbed my heart <laughs> because that was it, you know, this said to whoever sees it, this is who I am, this is who some other people that I know are. This is who you are, can be if you want to be.